I'm Ross Klein, lead designer of the Gridiron Trainer. Um, we started with the idea of, you know, where were we as a football brand? Um, and back when we started in cleats, it's like a heritage for us. So what we wanted to do is take information and the knowledge base that we had as a football, you know, a high football brand and bring it into the future. So that's what this gridiron trainer is. What we have is elements when we focus on people like Arian Foster and Julio Jones, who are athletes that are sponsoring this, is we looked at them in terms of explosive speed, stability, instinctual and adaptive type of qualities set as these athletes are. So what you're seeing here is elements of fit. Right? If you look down at the throat, you're gonna see this one piece, right? All the way underneath into the strap. Yeah. And it connects up into the tongue. Underneath this one piece is a stretch synthetic that allows it to adapt to the type of foot style that, that's in the shoe. When you get to the side profile, what we did is we really looked at the anatomy of the foot and focused on areas which are unprotected by bone. So you'll see areas like this, which are more structured. We call this system right here a zoned matrix. So really stable, very elastic, and then back up the stability up into the eye row. Still here is very protective and secure, protective and secure, but highly ventilated, right? And then we get into these components, singular components like this. And when you look at it from a package, it's really thin, but kind of the effect when you have it in your hand is uh, some areas are strong, some areas are soft, um, and it makes it very catered toward these athletes that we're focusing on, Arian and Julio. When you look at the bottom, we have our Micro-G foam, which keeps it very lightweight and extremely low to the ground. So being adaptive and the ability to move laterally, as well as what we call dorsiflexion in the heel, is what these athletes go through. So you're going to see also this traction, right? And the traction nubs, they're not so shallow, but enough to get you in and out of the turf, as well as wear around casually. But you'll see a very strong edge in the back, and then a more tapered edge in the front, and that's for the ability to kind of grab and release out of the ground. Um, and then what you have in terms of the dimensions of the forefoot and the heel, right, so if you look inside, you can see we even cord the heel a little bit so we get more breathability. But extremely f flexible, low to the ground, very responsive, um, and then an upper that's very lightweight and built pretty minimal. That's a gridiron trainer.